Hello everyone, this is Stephanie. Welcome to another video. So it's time to open the Potomac Bead Company's Best Bead Box for September. So for those of you who are not familiar with this, this is a bead box subscription that Potomac Bead Company offers on their website. Um, included in the box is one paper pattern and the beads you can use to make the pattern. Beads to add to your stash um, and use on other projects. Um, of course their website, uh, links to their website um, so you can look at all their different um, their beads and of course their YouTube channel which you know we know Potomac Bead Company's YouTube channel and Alley and they're just the best with the two hole beads um, so I'm going to open this up and I'm going to get a look at the beads together now I also have a coupon code and that for your 10% off your first box and it's Bronze Pony 10 I'll link that down below and I'll try to get it up here on the screen somewhere. Um, you can get this box for as little as $19.99 per month uh, if you, depending on the your subscription. So if you have the yearly, it's $19.99 per month and it goes up from there depending on your subscription. So the best thing to do is click the link down below to the website, check out each subscription and see if it's right for you, see if you love it. All right, so I'm going to cut this off and we're going to get started. Okay, so here, I've taken everything out of the box, I put that aside, and you get, here is the name of this box, it's Birds of a Feather, so I guess it's going to be all like sort of bird related, so you get a nice little paragraph kind of giving you, you know, a little setting the mood, and then here are the beads, and here is the pattern, so I'm here, and here are all the beads in the bag, so I'm going to take them apart one by one, I haven't really looked at this yet, so we'll be sharing this, you know, I'll be sharing with these looking at this for the first time with you. So um, we have one birds of a feather pattern and here's the pattern so it looks like this is a cabochon. Very cool, loving cabochons lately and a filigree flower so this, they've put the cabbage uh, attached it to this filigree flower. How cool is that? I love it. Alright so here are all the um, Instru all the materials you need for it, all this will be included inside, except, except the thread and the needle, I believe. Here's the written pat pattern. Also here they are sewing the beads to that filigree piece. Brilliant, love it. Okay, so I've done a few of these patterns and um, they're really well done. And look, all the, the, you've got lots of color illustrations. Um, this is all about Potomac beads. Here's Ali, the artist. and. I'm going to put that aside and we'll take a look at the beads. Alright, so here are the beads for the pattern. So let's take a look at those. So we have one filigree flower. So I have a lot of these filigrees and I've always been wondering what to do with them. What a great idea is to add some seed beads to them and use them as a background. Brilliant. Love it. This is 42 millimeters and it's a brass one. And you know, now I know what I'm going to do with my my other filigree pieces. I'm going to bead them. What a great idea. And put a capuchon in. All right, so that's the first thing for the birds of a feather pattern. So here it is right here. And then we have a glass cabochon, 25 millimeters. And you know, we've been doing so many cabochons lately. I absolutely love bezeling cabochons. So here we go. Got a little bird there going on there. I don't know what kind of bird it is. I'd say it's not a cardinal, but it's red. So here we go. So that's going to go like that. That's so cute. Uh, three grams of Miyuki seed beads and Eidos. That's this guy. And this looks like um, one of the iris, matte iris colors. Oh, that's pretty. I'm not going to take them out because it's, um, I can't seal it up again, but that's really a pretty sort of a green, a matte green iris. Love it. Great color. Five grams of Miyuki seed beads and 11 O's. Here, and this is sort of this, um, this looks like a topazy or reddish AB. Here's the number right there. Another one, very pretty. So that goes with the, the pendant. And then you get the 15 O's, 3 grams. Oh, and that's pretty. I love that. That's like a, like a mustardy color or like a yellow ochre color. And it's a matte bead. Love that. That's so nice. For, look at these fall colors. Love it. That's beautiful. Beautiful fall pendant. And then you get a tassel. So this is a silk tassel. I'm not going to pull it out. Well, here, I'll pull it out. That's a nice one, too. Wow, that's pretty. It's nice and thick and very, very well done. Beautifully, beautifully put together. Look at that. That's gorgeous. Love it. I'm going to put it back in its little 
plastic so that I don't mess it up. Love that's a really pretty pendant. I like it. So here, I really like it. So here, that those are all the pendant materials, and then you add the thread and you know and your needle. And then beads for your stash. So we have four silver plated finch charms. And I need to look for those. Oh, here they are. Oh, cute. So this is seven millimeter and they're little birds. So it is a definite bird theme. These are adorable. Look at these cute little guys. Love. I'd even maybe hang them from that little... And let's go a step further. Could we hang them from that little part of the beaded part on the tassel? Um, okay. And then one resin laser cut disc, 33 millimeters. This is beautiful. This is 33 millimeters. And look at that. That's gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I love that. Love. That is stunning. And then we have seven grams of check faceted drops, seven by 10 millimeter. Oh, these are beautiful. And these are kind of in a, um, like a, a root beer color. Okay, I'm gonna cut the, take these out, even though we can't get them back in. I'll just put them in a little plastic baggie. Those are very pretty, love. Brick stitch around these. I have a few videos where we do that. Just these colors are so fall. They're so beautiful. And then we have three grams of quadra lentil beads. All right, so they've they've. Um, I'm gonna have to cut these too. <laughs> so if I mess up the video, that means I'm gonna have to you know put everything in different bags. So to do it again. <laughs> so here's the quadra lentil, and all the numbers are on the bag, which is great. That's pretty. That's like a um, zinc iris, but a shiny sort of zinc iris, grayish, you know, it's grayish and kind of um, uh, bronzy color too. Oh, those are so pretty, love. And then we have four grams of Toho Demi Rounds. And these are, does it say what, it doesn't say what size they are. They look like, um, they might be Edo Demi Rounds. Let me cut these open. Yeah, these are definitely the bigger ones. So these are eight, Edo. That's a pretty color. That's like a peacock green color with the with the iris, you know, sort of like a fuchsia and bronze and that gorgeous, gorgeous green. Wow, these are beautiful. This is a these colors are speaking to me. Really gorgeous. And then we have three grams of pinch beads. And that's this guy open. Oh, and that's a pretty color. This is really pretty. What is it? Does it, it doesn't say the color, but it's, um, it's, it's like a, almost like a Picasso, right? With the sort of brownish red and green and black. Wow, those are pretty. These are just awesome colors. Pop those here. And then we have Two Potomac Crystal Pear Drops. These are amazing. Look at this. Are they, what's the size on these? These look like they're, I don't know, these 30 millimeter? Not sure. I should have measured them. They are big and gorgeous. Okay, you know we got to bezel these, right? Here, let me shine them up. There we go. Wow, look at that color. That is so pretty, like a peachy color. But look at the depth on those. Look at the sparkle. These are their crystals that they make. And they're very, very beautiful. Six check glass owl beads. Oh, these are adorable. Look at the little owls. So cute. Love. And I, as I said, I just love all these colors. Um, 10 pewter, let's see, here, hold on, all right, I'm going to go, it says pewter design beads, I'm going to say that that is this, these are a little like flower, 
Very pretty. Love all these little connecting beads. You know, they're just so great to have these small amounts of these beads around so that you can add them to the necklaces and such. 10 grams of checklist round beads, 6 millimeter. Let's open them up. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> did you hear that? Oh my God, they went everywhere. All right, I'm leaving this in, but here they are. <laughs> checklist. So you have 10 grams of these. That really went flying. I mean, and they're very pretty. They're kind of a, um, like a root beery color, brownish, you know, transparent with a gold wash on top. So partially gold. Gorgeous. Love those. And so does my, <laughs> my lap. <laughs> and then finally 20 brass daisy spacers. Here they are. So here's the, just, you know, again, another little spacer. I like that we have mattes and we have shinies and these beautiful, beautiful colors. All right. So here you go. That's your Potomac Bead Company Best Bead Box. Birds of a Feather Pattern. Love this guy. This is stunning. I love that. I love that little pattern for, and I love the idea of taking this and putting beads around here and putting, you know, and then bezeling that. Is that how they did that? Is that I'm really curious. Yeah, it's got to be some kind. I mean, it's some sort of bezeling, right? I don't know, but it's, I think it's just brilliant. Such a great idea. I've been wanting to figure out a way to use all my filigree, um, flat filigree pieces. Perfect. All right, so here you go. Enjoy this. Um, like I said, you know, you can get it for $25.99 a month, or you can go down to $19.99 per month, depending on how long your subscription is. So don't forget to click the link below. Check it out. See if it's right for you. See if you love it. Always check their website for any other deals. Uh, they were having some um, other, you know, um, deals with these. So check it out because you know, I don't want to say something that might not be true, but I, I do see periodically on their website where they have, you know, different, you know, deals to, um, you know, to go with the, um, the boxes. All right. So I'm going to say goodbye for now. So thanks for joining me and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.